Dice hola. Dice hola. 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 Dice hola. 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 Niño Tancho Why are you so angry? With us? Don't you know we love you? Is it your son? Your relationship so seemingly broken you cried to see it repaired? Is it your age? Weathered by the years? By the long walks, barefoot down the volcano slope, by the black choking smoke that engulfs you as you shape so expertly a tortilla for your daughter. Snow whitened hair flowing down your sun beaten skin like leather. Wrinkles transverse your tired face, and everyone knows when you cry and when you laugh. Maybe it's your soul tooth. That solitary obelisk in the center of your smile, now lost and gone forever. Why are you so angry, Nina? I will never claim to know why. The sadness goes beyond the clear waterfall walls of your eyes. I will travel as far as you will guide me and hold your hand as long as you let me. But stop. For just a moment, allow me to enjoy simply being in your presence. Showered in your humanity, right before my eyes, I don't think I've ever seen God this clearly. You just woke up and you said, This is the first day of my life. I'm glad I didn't die before I met you. But now I don't care, I could go anywhere. With you, and I'd probably be happy. The birth of the Chivo. Que onda, Antonio? Que onda? Chivo, Chivo. Gustavo, que tal? Black hair pulled loosely back in a ponytail and a baritone voice. A white t-shirt stained by that morning's work. And hands that have stories to tell. I look up to you. I can't explain why. See, me and you, we couldn't be more different. And maybe that's why I'm drawn in, closer and closer, wanting to delve into your mind. I hang on every word, every breath, every kayomda, every nawat prayer, every chivo. Perhaps if I can cross into one of your paintings or sculptures, I would arrive in some ancient Mayan shrine, surrounded by Mayan warriors, fighting for justice, fighting for their culture. And you, you would be at the helm, their fearless leader, their source of wisdom, their teacher, and I could witness the birth of the Chivo. Mi Padrigo. Three, four. To Hector, Mi Padrigo, my father, 
My friend, mi padre es salvadoreño, mi amigo. I've heard people describe you as the closest thing to Jesus, and I'd be hard pressed to challenge them on that. But I think a better title for you is the closest thing to human, to being truly human, to being the human being we're all called to be, with your backwards hat and your cheesy smile. I will miss your hugs, your words of wisdom, your beautiful ways, and that heart on your sleeve. You once said to me, Siempre estarás en mi corazón, as I hugged you from behind your shoulders and rested my head on your pecho. I don't know if you realize what you've done for me, the ways in which you've loved me, and challenged me, and encouraged me, <coughs> and moved me. And I wish I can give you more than my tears and a hug goodbye before I return home. But something tells me that'll be enough. Te quiero, mi padrigo. Siempre estarás en mi corazón. Daniel. Otra vez. Otra vez, huevo, huevo, chope, chope. Daniel, my experience in Las Nubes would not be the same without you in it. And if I could spend every day for the rest of my life making you laugh, I would. You always seem to have dirt on your face, in your hair, on your feet, and I always seem to have sweat on my back and on my neck, and on my arms. But you don't seem to mind, so I won't either. You always make my day, you and your beautiful family, Rosa and Gladys, and Cesar and Helgar. And when I speak of having a family here in El Salvador, I mean what I say. You are my family. We are family, as much as we can be. I've been saving things, saving our goodbyes and saving our tears for a later time. You understood me when no one else did. You accepted me as your friend, your brother. No language needed. Unconditional love. Will you remember me? You're so young, I don't know if you will, but I hope you do. And if you don't, I hope you at least remember that once, one time in the distant past, a stranger from some strange faraway land loved you and always will. Daniel. <laughs> Antonio va a bailar, ¿verdad? Sí. Mm -hmm. Sí. Sí, baila. I know that it is freezing, but I think we have to walk. Waving at the taxis, they keep turning their lights on.